Hey there, welcome to the 29th episode of The Daily Shed. Today I'm going to be uh, talking about triads a little bit, and triads are one of my favorite things on the guitar. Uh, not just triads in the harmonic concept of a basic chord, any chord, your first position chords uh, are triads, but really about using just three strings on the guitar to make a chord. And that's a full chord, and it can be very useful, especially when you're playing with another guitar player or want to do some variation. So I thought I'd show the intro to uh, Me and Julio Down by the Schoolyard by Paul Simon, because um, the intro is just a, just three triads next to each other, and it's a cool little lick to know, and it's nice for kind of getting used to playing just on a few strings of your guitar. So, it's, so the chords are basically an A major, a D6, back to A major, to E major, right? So you could play it down here. Like that. But what he does in the intro is he plays it like this. He's playing first the A, just the bottom three strings of the guitar. And you can reach this by playing just an A bar chord, an A major bar chord, taking the bottom three strings as a complete A chord. Second one is the D6. And you could reach this by doing a you know, D bar chord with a six. So it's just barring seventh fret on the G, B, and E strings. Back to A, and then E. And this E, it's the D shape. It's the same thing, just up two frets. So fourth fret on the G string, fifth fret on the B string, fourth fret on the E string. And you play it like this. It's a super bright, really cool, uh, distinctive sound. And uh, it would be really cool if you were playing with another guitar player and they were playing. And any time you have an A chord, you could substitute this that triad. Uh, same with the D. You know, any D major chord you could substitute with a six, or the regular D chord. D major chord is like this. Instead of the seventh fret on the E string, play on the fifth fret. Then the E string or the E chord. Substitute for any any E major. You just play this triad instead. It's also great for uh, some finger picking patterns as a variation. You know, I'm just going, you know, down, 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 middle, index, thumb. Another cool sound. So if you get used to these chords, get comfortable with them, then you'll start to be able to use them in other situations. Again, especially when you're playing in a duo um, or a band, or when you want to just provide some variation to this first position in the chords. So, I hope this is useful. As always, let me know any questions or comments you may have, and thanks so much for watching.